Hello everybody, this is Starman, and welcome to Let's Play Fallout New Vegas. I am the Doctor. Well, you may have noticed a little bit of a difference in the introduction here. I installed a mod that lets you play the Doctor Who opening theme, at least the classic uh, third Doctor opening as the game is starting up, but you never got a chance to see because I always start in the thick of the action. I thought it might be a nice change because I'm coming into this chapter having not played in a while since I've filmed the first batch of episodes. But we'll go ahead and continue from our last save. Which, if memory serves, we're getting ready to break into the Helios 1 facility. Just me, Eddie, JT, Willow, and Veronica. And while I could do a fair bit of robot punching with this, I think... The enemies in this one are actually such that I can use the sonic screwdriver as a weapon. As it is intended to be, anyway. My companions send something way before I do. Zero chance to hit. Well, in bats I don't, but with that. And with my companions, we actually have a very reasonable chance of doing quite well there. Okay. Good thing I'm so tough. And carry a ton of stim packs. I managed to take those in the face and disarm them just in time. So yeah, somebody clearly did not want anybody coming in here. We hadn't just destroyed all the turrets, that might have been useful, but as it is. And apparently I just made Willow want to be best friends forever. Yay me.
Well, heck, let's talk to Willow. And it was Eddie just starting to make a noise like we were about to be attacked, so... Do you have a minute? I have something I want to talk to you about. While you twerk, apparently. Yeah, what's going on? I told you, when we first started traveling together, that it wouldn't be for very long. But I'm having so much fun with you. And you've become very special to me. I think of you as a friend. As a best friend, actually. And I don't want to leave you, or the Mojave. So, what do you say? Should we make it official? Shall I stay and keep following you around? Yep, sure you can stay. I want you very much to stay with me. Yes, why don't you say it's working out well for me, too. Great! We'll be best friends forever. Anyway, let's see. Now we're best friends. We have some things to talk about. Wait here. Your leg? Would you look at it for me? I don't think it's healing right. It's still bothering me a lot. Sure, I'll look at it. You examine Willow's leg and see the wound was never cleaned properly. You clean the wound of debris and use antibiotics to clear up the infection. Willow should no longer experience any discomfort. That should do it. Thank you so much. And let's go. Do we have any things to talk about? Yes, absolutely. Are we going to celebrate or get something special from you? Let's go collection. When I scavenge for stuff to sell, I look for special little things that I might like to keep. I have a collection of those things. I haven't shown them to you because, well, a girl likes to have some privacy. And besides, not everyone I've traveled with has understood. What haven't they understood? That it's fun to find pretty or interesting things and keep them. And a couple of the people I've traveled with have made fun of me for it. I like to collect things too. I'm so excited you collect stuff too. What's your favorite thing to collect? Eh, things that are special. Those are my favorites too. Now celebrate? Do I get something? Yes, you do. So, the first present is, I made you a sweet roll to celebrate. But I'd also like to do something for you from now on, as your friend. I can cook for you, you know? Anything you want. You'll need to bring the ingredients, but I'll do the rest. What do you think? Thank you, Will. That's very sweet. Oh, good. It'll be fun. And, yeah, what the heck, you do get the option of changing your clothes at this point, which is kind of creepy and weird, but... Okay, I don't know what all this fuss is about, but, yes, if you're tired of seeing me in this outfit, I'm willing to change it. Happy? Okay, and... I'm done. No, I'm good. And yeah, we we get a kiss on the cheek, which kind of got covered up by that. But uh, yeah, well, after all that, nothing uh, jumped us. Hey, I could lock the garbage can with the sonic screwdriver. Wondrous piece of technology, that.
I just got some pulse grenades, which would be incredibly Please useful. Step into the open and identify yourself. Law abiding citizens have nothing to do. Please step into the open and identify yourself. Law this area clear. Okay, something somewhere is detecting us. Okay, apparently Sunk Screwdriver not as effective on these as I thought. At least not on Mr. Gutsy. Okay! Not sure where that was, but... Uh, good job, companion. Something somewhere is shooting at us. Ah, that would be Eddie's doing. Presume that was Willow's doing.
Let's see, mainframe is currently unresponsive. The amount of power reaching the terminal seems to be insufficient. All right, let's go ahead and restore power. Got a nice view of everything up What's here. That? Hi, I'm Willow. It looks like we'll be spending a lot of time together. Yeah, we uh, kind of covered that already, Willow. Thank you. Let's see. The console is unresponsive. For it to operate properly, you would need to be activated during peak sunlight hours, 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. The power configuration need to be set up in the tower's mainframe, and the two ground-level terminals would have to have a active uplink to the mainframe. Well, let's go ahead and wait 14 hours. Because I think we got everything else taken care of. At the very least, we got the uh, output uh, on the ground taken care of. Okay, power can reach the seven towers mainframe. Let's see, this robot doesn't fit a variety of tools specialized for industrialized maintenance. There's a slot at the back of it where it looks like a keycard could be fit. Science hardware robot to run, not repair mode. Alright, sufficient electricity should be running to the main theme from now on. Alright, configure the power grid. Let's see, we can use it to power up the full region. Fremont and West Side, we can strip. Let's go full region. Insufficient capacity, brownouts likely. Well, we can use the observation deck, which we just left, to try and get it to maximum output. going to be a mite blinding out here. And, you know, props to the game designers will need to be flash blinded immediately upon getting out of there. And we have the option of initiating Archimedes testing at this point, but we, uh, we do not want to do that.
Because even though it is one of the ways that we can win uh, Veronica over, there are other ways to do it that are a bit less uh, damaging in the long run. So with that done, we can get the heck out of here and talk to the uh, follower of the Apocalypse, which is probably the most doctor-friendly organization in this game. Be a bunch of scientists who just go around trying to help people. power to the grid. I saw that on the monitors here, and you sent it to everyone. Very admirable. Now that the NCR has more or less what they want, hopefully their curiosity about the plan is satisfied, and they'll dig no deeper. The followers will be grateful. Here, take these as a parting gift. I hope you'll find them useful. Okay, we got three stem packs, two doctor's bags, Fame with the followers of the apocalypse. And why are you still here? Keeping watch mostly. I'm trying to make sure the dangers of this plant are minimized. And we are now accepted among the followers of the apocalypse. And overburdened from the medical gear we have been given. Well, just to make sure, let's check with the jackass in charge officially and make sure that he's not uh, messing around with us too much. Yo! And yeah, he's got nothing, so... Adios, amigo. Alright, well, I'm gonna go ahead and shift inventory a bit. And next time, we will continue on down the road. I got a bit of a crazy idea for seeing if I can as I mentioned before, uh, get to the Black Rock uh, Super Mutant Lair without having to run the gauntlet. But we'll give that a try next time, I think, just for the fun of it. We will see you then.